Hello friends and welcome back to another adventure into How to Fool Boyfriend with your guide tag. So, let's just dive straight into this beautiful bird love save game. Today is Tanabata. I have no idea what Tanabata is. There's probably a ba bamboo tree in the plaza this year too. I think I'll go make a wish. Go make a wish. Be strong. Wow, the lots here are already. <coughs> wow, there's lots here already. Anybody I know? May mother stay healthy this year. May my stomach get better. Ryota. Impossible. Ne ne ze, ne pas français. I think that's how you pronounce that. Impossible. Impo impossible. Impossible. I don't know. I, I failed French. I tried taking beginner's French twice and I failed both times, so... Massacring the pronunciations. Yay! Oh. Morning conference on 10th. Leave 30 minutes early. Buy another alarm clock. May I wake up on time? Nanaki. Wednesday is garbage day. Remember. What kind of wish is that? What should I wish for? Conquer the world by force. Rule the world from shadows. Become a famous art. Okay. This took a bit of a turn. Let's rule the world from the shadows. That's more my thing. I wish to take the, the reins of power through clever schemes and rule the world from the shadows. Oh, hello. Is that you, Saint? Mr. Nanaki. You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know. I was about... I was about to head home. Would you like me to walk you to your place? Um. No. I mean, we're we're pretty capable. I mean, if any birds were trying to mug us, we'd probably so. No, thank you. No, thank you. I still have some errands to run. Oh, well, don't stay out too late. Was that the key mania? I, I have no. I don't know what the D is for actually. Shut up. <laughs> I mean, I know that I is one and X is ten. So D is a hundred. I don't know. Ah oh, well. Wasn't the key mania something public play to start today? Maybe I'll stop by the arcade. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Well, more m more charisma, I think. Or should we go? Yeah, I I know I'm ignoring the gym class, but I don't really care for gym, so. Music. I've been placed in charge of the timp timpani. What the heck is a timpani? All right. Uh, 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 add in uh, an image of whatever the hell on Timpan is here now. Okay, I still have no idea what it is, but you guys will know. So, last time it was the gong. What am I supposed to be? The musical gorilla? Australia leveled up. Charisma increased by five! Yay! We get our finals back today. I'm not sure I did too well. Saint! Sir! Well done. You've gotten even better. Keep up the good work. Yes, sir! Success! <laughs> Yay! Today's the last day. It's been a semester already. Sometimes it seemed long and sometimes it seemed short, but either way, it's summer now. I need to check all the assigned books before I go home. 
there will be a lot of students coming in to borrow their summer reading pretty soon. I don't care. Shh. Today is the closing ceremony, so there are few, even fewer birds in here than usual. Am I the only one? Well, that just makes my job easier. But I'm probably not alone. I've seen this situation before. Nageki? No reply. Maybe it's not here. Are you here, Nage- Please be quiet in the library. Hello! You're rather noisy today. Did you want something? Nope. I was just wondering if you were here. Of course. I'm always here. He replies from his corner in a somewhat annoyed tone of voice. Oh, the book he's holding. That's assigned reading this semester. Is it any good? Not really. I'm almost done with it. It forces its safe, ethical viewpoint on the reader, like all assigned reading. The whole concept is inane. Why force everyone to read the same books? It is pretty boring most of the time. What do you like to read? Huh? You volunteer to work here, so you must like books. I was wondering what to read next. So you want me to recommend something? He nods. What about... I have no clue what Orahato is, so we're gonna go with Night on the Galactic Railroad. I don't know what that is either, but it sounds amazing. What about Night on the Galactic Railroad? I liked it. Too stereotypical. Well, sorry! Oh, sorry. You've already read it, I imagine. Yes. Though, I liked it too. Ah! Yay! And so I spent the afternoon working in the library, occasionally exchanging a word with Nageki. Time flows slowly by. This sort of thing is nice too. It is indeed. I like Nageki. Excuse me. It's easy to fall out of practice and get fat and lazy during summer vacation. A hunter-gatherer's body is a way of life, so maybe I'll go running today. Running? <laughs> <clears throat> Lots of pretty places to see. What the fuck? Okay, I did not quite expect that one. What the hell happened there? Ar ar Alright then. Nothing to see there. <clears throat> ah, that was a good run. A true running girl's way to start vacation. I wonder how far I ran. I always lost track of where I'm going once the runner's high kicks in. Dot, 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 dot. Where am I? I must have wandered out my usual stomping around at some point. Which way did I come from? Don't fail me now, patholo pa paleo pa paleolithic homing instinct. The sun's setting. I'd rather not sleep outside. Hey you. I have no clue what this is, so... Question mark. Okay, uh, what? The hell can I bird are you? Um... <clears throat> what voice shall we give you? I don't know you. Where did you come from? A sparrow stands next to me, squinting up at my face. That's a sparrow? That's, that, that's not what the sparrows I'm used to look like. Or am I thinking of another word? B word bird. Bird's the word! <laughs> I'm sorry. Her, oh, it's, it's a girl! It's a girl bird. Okay, she needs a new voice then, I guess. Her wing is resting on a motor scooter. It looks a little bit vintage. How cute. I feel a strange pressure. I can tell right away that this sparrow isn't just any birdie. Um, I'm from St. Pidgeon Nations. I was out for a run and got lost. You ran all the way from there? You must be good. I have no- I can't do- I can't do voices. It's about- it's about a two hour drive from here. What? I guess that's why my legs hurt. Ah, uh, I wonder if I'll be able to run home again. Hmm. I like the cut of your jib. Anyone that determ- Anyone that determined deserves a ride home. Come on. The intimidating sparrow gestures at her scooter. It's a little small, but we should both fit. I think. S thank you. Uh, may I ask your name? Koshiba Amsami. I sell takoyaki. 
Call me Asami. Then thank you, Asami. Oh, uh, no, no picture. Dot, 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 dot. You're a very cautious driver. Carve it into your soul, kid. One accident is all it would take, and that would be the end of both our lives. It may seem strange to a young girl like you, but once you've lost someone, you'll understand. There's a far-off look in her eyes. I'm sure you know what you're talking about, but at this rate, I might get home faster by walking. Do you think we'll get there by dawn? Carve it into your soul! The speed limit for scooters is 30 kilometers per hour. We're not even going that fast. Following traffic laws is part of my credo. Isn't riding tandem against law too? That rule is for humans. Birds are light, so one or two more doesn't stop the brakes from working. We're fine like this. But I'm not a bird. And so we put it along at Asami's hyper cautious speed. By the time we got to my house, it was almost light out. Damn. It's still a long time until the semester starts, and I still have a lot of homework. Maybe I should apply for a part-time job since I have the chance. I'll... Hmm. Yeah, let's get a job. Well, let's be responsible. <laughs> I think I saw a flyer at the station hiring high school students over the summer. It was a cafe, right? It's beautiful in here. Oh my! Pardon me, miss, but we're not open yet. If you could come back at noon... Oh, sorry, I was here to ask about the job. The proprietor of a cafe is an extremely... Ah! I'm sorry, but my nose keeps itching. There we go. <laughs> so, the proprietor of the cafe is an extremely elegant parakeet. A true gentle bird without a doubt. This must be what people mean when they refer to, refer to uh, mature attractiveness. All the students at school are young and hyper, and the most, and the 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 most digni and the most dignified birds there are the teachers. Oh, is that right? Forgive me. I don't know. I need. To, I'm called Urushihara Kensaburo. I need a picture to have a voice here. I think. I am the owner of Torimi Cafe. I'm Saint Australia. Welcome, Miss Australia. I hadn't expected a human. Um. Uh. Are you going to interview me? I do not see any need to test such a wonderful young lady's desire to work here. And I believe you will be much more capable than I am at moving the boxes of coffee and tea about. I'll be glad to. After all, I am a vitality girl. <laughs> I shall be relying on you for this summer then, Miss Astraya. It is perhaps a little sudden, but could you start tomorrow? Of course. I am glad. I shall be waiting here for you. I shall be waiting for you here, in my cage. Tomorrow then, Miss Astraya. Today's my first day working at Mr. U it's okay, so, so it's a guy at Mr. Urushihara's cafe. I think I'll leave early to make a good impression. Alright, let, let's see if I can find a good voice for, for, for this bird. <clears throat> good. 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 Good morning, Miss Australia. No, that's not good either. Fuck. I'm sorry, no, no cursing. Um. Holy shit. Good, 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 good morning, Miss Australia. I think that would work, yeah. Good morning, sir. Let me start by showing you where everything is. I'm sure you'll be able to remember everything soon, so please ask if you can't find something. He shows me around the cafe, explaining everything inside. The shop is small, and he keeps everything very tidy, so I'll be able to remember it all. Well then, what do you think? It's very nice. I almost want to move in. Come now, it's far too plain for a young lady such as yourself. Actually, compared to my hat, Excuse me? <clears throat> um, I saw the flyer at the station and... Ryota? Astra Astraya? What, what, what are you doing here? A friend of you? A friend of yours, Mrs. Astraya? Oh yes, this is Ryota. Oh, the voices. You came for the job too, Ryota? Yeah, 
I saw a search at noon, so I thought I could fit it in after my other job. But if you already got the position, then that's that. Um, Mr. Urushihara, could you use two people? Hmm, hum. Thirdly, my cage is too small to have that much work to do. I should... Oh, but he needs the job more than we do. I mean, we, we mostly took it because su summer, so... I'm gonna let Ryota have this job. And hopefully that means one, one less voice to do. Mr. Rushiara, I, do you think you could take Ryota instead of me? Estrella! I don't see why not, but... I don't really need the job, but Ryota does. Don't worry, he's a hard worker. Are you sure, Estrella? It's not really fair to you. I do feel a little bad leaving on my first day, too, but... Ryota has worked several jobs every summer to support his mother. Mr. Urushihara is a real gentleman, and Ryota deserves to be treated nicely. This is for the best. I know you'll do a good job, Ryota. I... Thanks, Estrella. Well then, our encounter has been as transient as a comet's tail on the horizon, but I am glad I met you. Please do stop by. I will always be here, Miss Australia. I will. Thank you, Mr. Urushihara. So we're being nice. And yes, today is the lot that the that's the last step today. <clears throat> this is the end of the episode, that's what I was trying to say. I I didn't do words. I don't do words well today, apparently. So, with that out of the way, thank you everybody so much for joining me on this adventure into How to Full Boyfriend, and I hope I'll see you in the next one as well. This is Tag, signing out. Bye-bye!